Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelly. If this is your first time stopping by, thanks for joining. Today's video is going to be me attempting to refresh um, my straight hair. I was wrapping it in the beginning pretty much every night and then there were a couple nights that I just forgot to. I also forgot to put my satin pillowcase back on my pillow after I washed it and so it got a little like messy. But either way, my hair is also very dirty so it's greasy but I've never been one of those people that could just use a dry shampoo and it just make my hair look normal. Um, I get like product buildup on my scalp or I don't know, maybe a little bit of dandruff, but oil and dirt and all that other. So I was looking for a product that could actually like cleanse my scalp without me needing to wet my hair and shampoo it because it's just going to revert back to being curly and I wanted to see if I could stretch my straight hair out a little bit longer. So I found this Batiste No Rinse Shampoo. Um, this is their waterless cleansing foam. It's supposed to give instant hair refresh, dries in 60 seconds. This does um, contain dimethicone, in case you were wondering. Um, I already have some silicone in my hair from when I straightened it. If you haven't seen that video, check it out. It was my first time straightening my hair in like over a year and a half. Um, but I picked this up, it says it's for normal to dry hair. But for me, dry shampoo didn't really do anything other than just like cause more buildup in my hair. So I want to see if this will actually cleanse my scalp because my scalp is dirty and flaky. Um, and you know how like when you scratch your scalp and there's like gunk underneath your fingernails? That's what we got going on right now. Okay, so when I first straightened my hair, it was pin straight. And remember I said that's how I like it because um, over the course like of time, it's going to start to get more and more frizzy um, like it is right now. It's also kind of like I was outside and it rained a teeny bit on my hair, but even just like, you know, you sweat while you sleep and just gunk and dirt. So my, my roots are a teeny, like the smallest bit oily. The directions seem to be pretty simple. It just says shake well, turn the can upside down and apply foam directly into your hand. Massage into dry hair until absorbed and repeat as required. Voila, instantly refreshed hair that dries in 60 seconds. Um, let's see, hopefully this doesn't revert my hair. Um, but if it does, oh well, then we'll just have to go back curlier, curly sooner than later. Okay, so I'm just, I just want to do like sections. Let's do, I want to take a tiny, tiny, like the smallest amount I can. It looks like one little squirt. It smells very light and refreshing and tropical. Okay, so it doesn't feel like a mousse. It's like almost evaporated. the hair because you can see my curls my hair is trying to revert a little bit here at the roots it has a not sticky feel to it but it's like you can feel the product but my hair did dry very quickly and it doesn't feel like it's reverting at the roots or anywhere else 
I can still feel the product on my hair, so I would probably save this towards the end um, of my straight hair. And while well, inspecting my hair, I can still see uh, flakes. So I don't know about that. I don't know, y'all. I just don't think I'm a fan of these types of products because I thought it might be cleansing my scalp, but I'm looking at it and my roots are definitely like have the slightest bit of curl to them. The front here definitely is starting to revert and then the back here towards the root has the slightest wave, like not enough for me to be upset about. If I had done this on third or fourth day hair, I probably would have been way more upset, but on two week old hair, it doesn't, doesn't really bother me. But I don't think it's cleansing as much as I thought it was. I mean, there's not much underneath like my, I know this sounds disgusting. There's not much underneath my fingernails, but I can just feel my roots just feel yeah, like gunky, dirty, thick. Um, like the bottom of my hair just feels so much more light, airy, <laughs> cleaner. <laughs> it just kind of feels dirtier. <laughs> It doesn't feel like when I first washed it, and I guess this isn't necessarily supposed to replace your shampoo, but I was hoping it would give me some type of difference. I don't necessarily know if my scalp feels any different per se. And this is a tiny, tiny little bottle. This is 3.6 ounces, and I feel like I've used maybe a third of the bottle with just this one application. So I don't know how much you would actually get out of it. I think I'm just one of those people that when I straighten my hair, I get like a week, maybe I should drop some tea tree oil into my scalp and then maybe I could get another week out of it. But other than that, I don't really see myself investing too much into these. Um, if you have one, like if you have similar problems as me and you have one or you have a technique that you really love that actually like cleanses your scalp essentially um, and refreshes your hair so that you can stretch your straight hair out longer drop your tips down in the comments below to let your girl know I think this would be really good if you had um, protective styles so any type of braids if my hair was in um, a like twist out if I still had the twist in if I had braids in um, I think that'll be really good then because you could get in there and actually massage per se um, without needing to actually wet your hair if you're not around water if you don't have the time to do that then this will probably be really good for that so I'll keep it around for that and then we shall see um but yeah that is everything don't forget to comment rate subscribe thanks so much for watching and I will see you in the next video bye